Welcome to Allergy and Asthma Care of New York. I'm Dr. Cliff Bassett. I'm an allergist here in New York City for over 15 years' time. What we do in my office and will present in just a few seconds is a virtual tour and learning about how we identify what allergies you may have if you or a family member has allergies, whether it be a food, indoor allergy, outdoor allergy, if you have hives, you have skin problems, or if even you have other types of problems such as asthma, and how we can figure out how it affects you in your daily lives, investigate through very simple testing that will show you exactly how it's done, and come up with answers in terms of what the next step is for you to come up with some solutions to your allergy dilemma. We need to live with the environment, and our job is to educate you and work with you and your healthcare providers to make that happen. So welcome to our virtual allergy tour, and I'm looking forward to showing you more about what we do here in Allergy and Asthma Care of New York in just a few seconds. So this is the procedure we go through here in the office in terms of investigating if you have allergies or not. Whether it be an adult or a child, it's a very simple procedure. Thank you for joining us today, Romy. You're welcome. And basically, the first thing we do is alcohol off the arm to make a nice and clean work surface. And then we use a variety of trays. And this particular system is the Comfort 10. We can test you for 30 allergens in about 10 seconds. And it's virtually painless. And we can find out if you have an allergy based upon the skin test to a food, a medication, or even an indoor and outdoor allergen, such as a dust mite, pet hair, pollens in the park. And it's very simple. We just take a little piece of plastic that has a little bit of allergen on, attached to it, and that's pretty much it. Feel anything at all? Barely, no. Any pain at all? No, not at all. Okay. So it's very reproducible, it's reliable, and it's very easy to do. We can usually test you within 10 or 20 minutes and find out a great deal about what makes you tick. And if you're allergic to something, and the best thing about it is then you'll have the answer. Next option after that is options and treatments, and we'll get to that in a little bit. And after we place this on your skin for about 10 to 20 minutes, we can find if you have a likely food allergy by looking at the skin test response, which is usually nothing more than a slight redness or area of itchiness or swelling indicating whether you have a food allergy. Patients are learning more about food allergies and how they affect you. In about one out of three individuals who have seasonal allergies, foods can actually make your seasonal allergies worse and you can actually have a double whammy from what's in the air as well as what you put into your mouth. And we'll identify that and help you understand that a little bit better when you're here in our office going through the evaluation. One of the things I like to do is to educate all about allergies and how it affects us. And this is an example of something we did with Women's Day on Ask the Expert. In this particular case, we were asked, how do I choose an air filter for my home? Does it help if I have indoor allergies? Should I have a humidifier during the winter months when things are very dry indoors? And so it's very important to understand when you have an evaluation, we want to take the most late-breaking information in terms of how to apply your allergies, your symptoms, and devices and things we can do to make you better. And that's another step in the right direction is getting the right information to take care of yourselves and your family members. So we're going to do a breathing measurement called a spirometry. It's a way to tell the lung capacity. And the test is very simple to do and it can be done in about 10 seconds or so. Why don't you take that. When I tell you now, I'm going to activate the computer. Go ahead. Take a deep breath. Blow it hard. Keep going all the way out, all the way out. Good. Breathe in now. Breathe in, breathe in, breathe in, breathe in. Good. Sit down, please. And your results are excellent. Very good. And the lung capacity ind indicates how powerful your lungs are. And it's an important measurement, particularly in people who have allergies, sinus, and respiratory problems such as asthma. Here's another example of a publication we work with, Men's Health, and really getting out there and educating people about why people get allergies. Allergy is normally a harmless substance that causes the immune system to go haywire. And it's very important to understand it's based upon your genes. So if your family have allergies, or your parents, it's a good chance you may suffer as well. And this particular piece, we talked about how the body responds when you have allergies to some things such as a tree pollen in the park and how we test you and understand how it affects you. In this particular case, we talked about this with Men's Health, and we really like to work with a variety of different magazines in this capacity to educate men, women, and children about how to take care of themselves when they have allergies. And remember, it's all treatable. Thanks for visiting with us today, and I hope this virtual allergy tour was helpful and informative. We really look forward to seeing you if you or a family member have allergies so we can get you properly treated. Allergies are on the rise. New York City, throughout the world. And we really strive to educate our patients, teach you about the allergies that you may have, and learn preventive strategies and get you well treated. We look forward to seeing you.